Hi everybody, happy Mother's Day! Whee! Welcome to the Power of Mom! And I'm so excited because it's going to be my second Mother's Day in my life. And um, right now I'm making a video because I'm totally running late. I'm actually running on 36 hours of no sleep. So I think I look pretty good for not sleeping because I had... My Mother's Day week is kind of hectic, and but it's all good, you know. It's just funny what people say sometimes. I don't know. I just know that the people that know me know that I don't do certain things or say certain mean things, and that just made me feel better when I know that certain people know how I am. So whatever other people are trying to say that... I did or whatever. That just shows that they got no soul. Got no soul. I don't know. Ugh. But anyways, I decided to start our video. Huh? Oh, she wanna be on it too? Huh? Yeah, you got stuff on your forehead. Anyways, um huh? I need to see you. Yeah, as you can see, I was doing legal stuff on my filing cabinet. Anyways, um, I am going to share with you guys some really good ideas for Mother's Day present, Mother's Day's presents, because, you know, I'm pretty sure you guys are running out of ideas, and I think I'm pretty smart and amazing, so here are some ideas. Um... I'm going to show you what I'm going to give my mom, and the only reason I feel comfortable posting this is because I know my mom doesn't watch my videos, so, eh, I guess I'm not the favorite, okay, I don't think she knows how to use the internet so well, okay, so, one thing is that I've tried giving my mom jewelry, and also my grandma, and they the jewelry that they're kind of going to like is really expensive, like gold and stuff. And um, I like silver, as you guys can tell. I'm a silver and diamonds person. And um, it's just we never match. And this last Christmas for Christmas, I got jewelry that I gave to somebody. I got it back. And I was just kind of like, hold on a second. I didn't even give you these ones over here. That's not my taste. I didn't give you this. Anyways, so I am t trying to stray away from jewelry just because I feel like they don't really wear it. Like, they wear their own, but the same ones over and over again. And I buy them new stuff, and they don't even wear it because they like the same stuff they use. Um, but this last Thanksgiving, my family, for Black Friday, everybody got tablets. They didn't get me one. Um, but one thing is that the speakers don't work that well. And um, my mom and I, li I like to Skype. And most of the time I'm like yelling at my mom because like she can't hear me. So for Mother's Day, I got her some Bluetooth speakers. You see? Bluetooth? -y? And they're wireless. And... It says it has a microphone, so I'm guessing my mom could kind of have it like this while we're Skyping. I don't know. But it's just, I think that would be super fun so that we can be talking and having our daily conversation without always being like, what? Can I hear you? Huh? So, that's my mommy's gift. And I think she's really, really going to like it. And I feel so stupid because I should have gotten one for my grandma. Because she has a tablet, um, but I forgot. I still don't have her present. Um, but I was, I think, I'm thinking of trying to find one of these. Hopefully, I can get a good deal because I got this one on clearance. Well, not not clearance. I got it at a really good price because it's a store that sells electronics. One Mother's Day present that never goes wrong is buying an orchid. And they're so easy to take care of because you only have to put like three ice cubes once a week. So every Sunday before you go to church or Monday 
Monday when you're going to start your work week. You just put three ice cubes and in a semi well lit area and you will have the most beautiful orchid. Now, um, I gave one to Mommy Nagel, my second mama, three years ago and I think theirs is still working. But this is the one that she gave me last year. Now, um, I've kind of forgotten to water it, but it's still standing. I, I'm going to try to water it again and revive it. No, that's my balloon. But, hey, you see, I ain't that bad. Oh, it has a flower that blooms. So, I know. But no, but usually orchids are really good, good and easy. I am just the worst plant owner in the world. I, I really am. I've tried all sorts of plants and I forget to water them 100% of the time. Minus the few times that I don't forget to water them. So that's still 100% of the time. Um, so that's a really, really good idea. Another thing that you can give them. Oh, another thing that I was thinking of giving my grandma, because she's diabetic, I tend, well, we sometimes, depends who, cousins or whatever, we like to give her a whole bunch of, like, diabetic candy, like chocolates and stuff, and she loves it because it's so expensive and it's so nom noms, and it just kind of makes it, like, I don't know, like, and it's a nice treat, because a lot of times things that last longer... Yeah, they last longer, but it just make take up more space. And sometimes, you know what? A good-ass chocolate is all you need. So that's another idea for Mother's Day. Um, I was actually kind of thinking, technology-wise, buying an uh, external drive for your parents. You know how, like, our parents, you know, they tend to just always have the same little flash drive for their cameras. You know, just give them an external so that they can keep on taking more pictures and more pictures and not feel like they always have to delete pictures and you know just an easy way to store pictures I think that's a really good Mother's Day present you can get your mama a makeover make her feel beautiful you can do that get her makeover a massage that would be nice or get her some jewelry um something unique or like um, you know like those Hawaiian flowers that they have that they mean something like simplicity or loyalty, loyalty and something and something those are really cute too you could always give um, a picture frame with a face on it like that and like this like, oh my god you can do like eye and then a little and then with your baby. What else can we do for Mother's Day, Jojo? Hmm. We'll take him out for dinner. But you see, for me, I like celebrating Mother's Day, like for going out, not the day of, because it's too crowded. And I would rather just do something outdoorsy. Like, I'm hoping Sunday um, I can just go out and do something outdoorsy with my son because I don't know. Just going out to eat and blah blah blah. And just, to me, it makes me happy seeing my son happy. So I would love to do something cute and romantic like that with my little JoJo. Maybe going to the beach. He loves the beach. That would be fun. Hopefully the weather is good. You can always do... I was actually thinking of making little hand and foot print um, ah! ceramic plate. Ah! Like for... Ah! Even though it's from Mother's Day, it's like from my mom. Because I know my mom would appreciate a really cute detail from my son. Um... So arts and crafts are always good Mother's Day presents. Or, ooh, who doesn't love getting woken up with breakfast? If, you know, you don't have the fun getting woken up with breakfast in bed. Or you do 
all the dishes back there and cook for her. That would be nice. I would hope Jojo would do that for me and care for me and love me forever and ever. And what else? Do you guys have any other good ideas for Mother's Day? I'm trying to think. Maybe you guys can give me a good idea to give my grandma because that's the one I'm struggling, struggling a little bit as to what to give. Um, because I'm really broke. Really, really broke. And my mom's present. I've been saving that for a while. Because <sighs> that's my mom. But, and I'll be brainstorming. But yeah, you guys, enjoy your Mother's Day. You worked so hard. You have shown love and affection to little tiny beings that depend on you. You are amazing. You are a teacher. You are a lover. You are an inspiration. You are everything God wanted you to be. To create life. To create awesome people. And my nose is itchy. Sorry. Uh. But, yeah, you guys. I'm going to let you guys go. I am super tired, but I didn't want to leave you guys without, without a video for this week. I have more ideas of videos to make, but um, this is this week. Happy Mother's Day. Have fun doing your barbecues, your fancy dinners, your lovey doveys you know, giving you lovey doveys and... Oh my lovely dovey, yes you are. Um, um, just, just kiss him. Um, ah. Right? Give me a kiss. Um. So yeah, I love you guys. Take care. Be safe. And just breathe. And relax. And we will see you guys next week. To the power of mom. And you guys remember, don't give up on yourselves because when you give up on yourselves, you are showing your children to give up on themselves and you would never give up on your children. Bye!